What's going on guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name's Michael Remen, aka All Fires. Now we're inching closer to this next look at Deadpool and Wolverine, and I think here is the good news. There's been so much merch at CinemaCon all over the place, and I'm not just talking about the first cups that we saw with Deadpool and Wolverine in the cowl. We're getting so many leaks for different promotional materials. I think there's a good chance that some footage is going to be shown tomorrow. As always, I'm just optimistic, fingers crossed, they're going to decide to show it to the public. In the meantime, we have a huge reveal, and not just something animated or illustrated, but rather for the first time an actual HD rendering of characters and from the film. Official promo art revealing our first look at the Deadpool core. We're going to go over where this came from, what's included. There is one variant that they switched out. We've talked about it in previous videos. We'll cover that again, Then we'll also go over the real possibility we're getting some brand new footage at least shown behind closed doors tomorrow and from Marvel Studios. We're breaking it all down, the latest official promo revealing the Deadpool core for Deadpool and Wolverine but first if you could grab the subscribe button we do daily Marvel content at the channel and that's all we do everything from official Easter egg breakdowns trailers and reviews to the occasional industry insider report and rumor like we're covering today and everything in between so if that sort of things for you hit the subscribe button leave a comment down below that will automatically enter you to win our ongoing PS5 giveaway the next one is right around the corner with the finale of X-Men 97 again all you got to do be a sub leave a comment if you want stick around to the end of the video we get into all the giveaway stuff again there. Okay, so as I mentioned again in the prologue, I would be totally shocked if there wasn't some actual footage coming tomorrow. We have been getting so many promotional images and directly from CinemaCon, even the Hollywood Reporter got in on this last one that broke this afternoon. And after just having seen those cups yesterday, this is a brand new promotional piece that was in a photo booth. And again, it's been one day after another. We just keep getting more and more reveals for Deadpool and Wolverine. And it certainly feels like it's all gonna culminate with new footage tomorrow. But I think the bigger reveal comes in the other piece of promo art that got posted. And again, it was within the last 20 minutes of me firing up this video, but this did not come live from CinemaCon, rather from the Twitter scoopster and anonymous industry insider, Can We Get Some Toast, who posted this official promo art with our first look at the characters from the film in the Deadpool core. While we did get this reveal about two weeks ago, they were literally animated silhouettes and in the word snicked underneath Wolverine. Here specifically, we're seeing HD renderings and of the characters from the movie, and we can tell that because starting with Dogpool, this is the Dogpool from the film. And actually, Dogpool's character was one of the first official reveals that Ryan Reynolds ever put on Instagram and back when they originally had started filming. So we knew exactly what he would look like, and here he is. Now using that as the litmus, it actually informs the rest of these characters, and from left to right, we have Headpool, which interestingly enough, has spawned a very awesome theory on the internet where a lot of people think that Headpool is going to be played by Ryan Reynolds and rather just the head left over from the end of Wolverine Origins. And that was the whole reason for the post credit scene. I, I actually love that. We also see two variants in Kidpool, which incidentally, and coming from the same industry insider, can we get some toast? We may actually know who's playing Kidpool. Now, the actor who was named but is not yet confirmed was Walker Scoble, which makes a lot of sense because that was the same actor who played the kid version of Ryan Reynolds in The Atom Project, which was also directed by Sean Levy. And of course, he just did Percy Jackson and the Olympians over on Disney, so it seems like a natural choice. And the fifth member shown is, of course, Baby Pool. And depending on whether or not they ever show his face, I assume this character might just be CGI and the entire time. Now, while we haven't seen anything to do with the Deadpool core and just yet from the trailers, lightest of spoiler warnings, we did have that behind the scenes footage that not only showed Dogpool and our variant of Deadpool, but another different Deadpool variant we don't have the official name for, although we've affectionately referred to him as Champion Deadpool. That also tells us that it won't be just this version of the Deadpool core, there'll be other variants included because usually Lady Deadpool is a member of the Deadpool core. We've gone over that in previous videos. You would expect her to be along the lineup as she featured prominently in the Deadpool core from the comics. Every time, however, we've seen promotional art for the team, and this marks the third time now, and with these HD renderings of characters from the film, she's been excluded. But she will be in the film, and we know that for various reasons, not only the industry insider plot leaks and such, but of course, that frame from the first trailer that showed someone with inverted color gloves shooting Uzis. That's undoubtedly Lady Deadpool. No, not played by Taylor Swift, more likely played by Blake Lively. 
Thanks to the anonymous Twitter scoopster My Time to Shine Hello, who indicated that quote unquote someone closer to Ryan Reynolds would be playing Lady Deadpool. Now, as this all relates to that footage tomorrow, because a lot of you asked me today, especially in my DMs, is there new footage? Is there a new trailer? And can we expect to see it? Guys, I am optimistic it won't be one of those cases where they just show it behind closed doors. But as I mentioned, I think in yesterday's video or the day before, uh, Marvel Studios has a habit of that. They did it a lot in 2022. And by most accounts, even new updates coming today, that second trailer isn't coming until mid-May, which is over a month off. So if anything, whatever they show tomorrow, unfortunately, is probably going to be disseminated through secondhand accounts, which we will cover at the channel. And if you're wanting to stay peeled sort of to the internet to see if anything comes up, again, Disney's panel goes live tomorrow at 2.30 p.m. That's 5.30 p.m. on the East Coast, 2.30 on the West Coast. Keep in mind, I've been to several live Disney presentations. They normally save Marvel Studios towards the end, if not closing it out. And the panel runs for two hours and 15 minutes so it'll probably be closer to four on the west coast and seven on the east coast before we start hearing about new details if that footage dropped and my fingers are crossed for some reason that the industry insiders haven't seen it coming this week and that marvel will also give us a look at this footage uh tomorrow night but i doubt it let me know all your thoughts down below quickly let's get into the giveaway stuff before i let you go Okay, we're still giving away PlayStation 5s here at the channel, and we're going to continue to do so until the PlayStation 5 Pro comes out, and then we'll switch over. In the meantime, we just announced a brand new winner for the launch of X-Men 97. In fact, he just DM'd me on Instagram, showed me a picture. He just got it this past weekend. We'll have another winner next month to coincide with the finale of X-Men 97. If you want to be entered to win, or for any of the other future giveaways here at the channel, all the same rules will always apply. Hit the subscribe button because you need to be a subscriber, then leave a comment down below and because it's truly random, the more videos you comment on, the better chance you have of winning. All winners will always be announced live in the end of the video with my voice in the winning comment shown on screen. If you liked today's video, I'd sincerely appreciate it if you hit the like button and the best way to keep up with the content here at the channel is to hit the notification bell with all notifications turned on. Please stay safe and vigilant on any YouTube channel where prizes are given away regularly. Years ago, we dealt with a problem that apparently is still rampant on the platform as they've been targeting my friends channels that is to say if you're anywhere instagram youtube any platform and you should get a comment please try to remember that anybody can take a content creator's photo claim to be that content creator and the whole ruse is to comment that you've won something and then get you to respond never share your information on a third party app like telegram or whatsapp and please try to remember that no content creator not myself or anyone else will ever charge you for the shipping if you win a prize for that channel that's a dead giveaway that it's a scam be safe, be vigilant, and if you should get a comment like that, again, on any platform, report the comment directly to the platform. YouTube is super fast about deleting those comments, and you're really doing everybody at the community a service, not just helping out the content creator, but everywhere that account has commented now disappears. So just think of how many people you're saving going through the same mess. The best way to keep up with the content at the channel has always been to hit the notification bell with all notifications turned on. And as always, if you like today's video, I'd appreciate it if you hit the like button. My name is Michael Roman. Find me in a couple of places, Instagram and Twitter at Amfires. You can also find me on Spotify, YouTube, Amazon, Apple, iTunes, wherever you listen to original music with the name All Fires. And while I sincerely appreciate you checking my music out, thanks for checking this channel out. Stick around. We'll be posting again real, real soon.